Did you know that gold straight out of the earth isn't pure? When extracted using methods like amalgamation or cyanidation, gold contains impurities like zinc, copper, silver and iron. So how do we get the dazzling 99.99% .99 pure gold we see in jewelry and electronics? Let's dive into two key purification processes, the Miller process and the Wall-Will process. First up, the Miller process. Imagine melting impure gold into liquid form. At temperatures above gold's melting point, you blow gaseous chlorine through this molten metal. What happens? Impurities like zinc and iron react with the chlorine, forming chlorides that float to the surface as slag. These are easily skimmed off, leaving behind gold that's about 99.5% pure. This method is fast and efficient, perfect for an initial purification step. To take purity to the next level, we use the Volwill process, which relies on electrolysis. Here's how it works. You take a casting of impure gold and place it in a solution of hydrochloric acid and gold chloride. When an electric current passes through, the gold dissolves from the anode, the positively charged electrode, and migrates as ions to the cathode, the negative electrode. There, the gold is deposited as 99.99% pure. Impurities either settle as sludge or stay dissolved in the solution. It's a fascinating way to refine gold to its highest quality. So, which method is better? The Miller process is quick and cost-effective, but stops at 99.5% purity. Meanwhile, the Volwill process produces ultra-pure gold, but comes with a catch. It's expensive and requires large amounts of gold in the electrolyte solution. Newer methods, like recovering gold directly from solutions, can reduce costs and improve efficiency making the gold purification process even more advanced. From molten gold bubbling with chlorine gas to cutting-edge electrolysis, the journey of gold purification is a blend of science and precision. These methods don't just give us pure gold, they drive industries, power innovation and even shape economies. Isn't that incredible?